kind of got a mess going on, don't we? Mm. Yours. <laughs> yours <laughs> one of that one on me. Mm. Your mower. stick you could bring? <laughs> Did you get a stick? Come here. Tell everybody hi. Unamused this morning. Unamused. Ryder. Tell him hi. Say hi. It's kind of cloudy. It looks like it may rain. Uh, Dolly's going to school with us this morning, and it's Friday. Uh, Jason's already taken riders, so we're not forgetting. Uh, coffee, farm. I'm gonna start my barn chores. Uh, it is farm focused farmer Friday, so uh, go out and support your favorite farmers. Whether it be visiting your local farmer's market tomorrow, checking in during planting season, making them some cookies or dessert, because of what better way to show your appreciation than to show up with goodies. <sighs> Good morning, babies. So I do have Shiloh up in the stall. We've been kind of slowly kind of legging her up. She is supposed to be bred. Um, Someday she looks like she might have a baby, and sometimes I can't really tell. So, I need to get her ultrasound by our vet. Maybe I'll call on that today. Um, anyway, I did talk to uh, another mutual vet technician friend. Um, she's just too far away for me to utilize, unfortunately. And she said we could leg up Shiloh, and that makes me really happy. So... Even if she is pregnant, I can still do some slight, slight, light workouts with her. Um, feed her and uh, love on her. And I'm going to use her with, with helping with, with some with Leo because he's crabby and lazy. 
So, yeah, we'll just have to be interesting to see how yours does or how ours does. And, Yep. I've actually got some other places I'm wanting to do too. So I may end up doing like... When you don't feel like mowing. Or weed eating. You bring Big Mama up. Ah, does she look pregnant to you guys? <laughs> I may just get the best birthday present ever. Okay, that's not true. I've had a couple good ones. What do you think, Shy? I do miss running. Guess that just means I've got to work extra hard with Leo. So, we're going to let Shiloh eat some grass. I'm going to go saddle Leo. And, uh, Graham, you're going to have to find your way out of the round pen. So this is one of the ongoing projects. Yeah, there's always a project, right? Forever and always on the farm. Um, getting new fencing put up around what I is called the dry lot area behind the horse barn, in between the horse barn and the cattle barn, behind the chicken barn. Um, Jason so graciously helped me rip the fence out last week. And now we are in the process of trying to figure out what exactly it is that we want in certain areas. Um, Shiloh's just out eating grass and wandering. But we're considering doing continuous paneling from the barn front down to the cattle barn area that will match the arena fence, the five, six rail, I think it's six rail, six rail panel. Um, and then I would like to come in and scrape all this. Carol's already started quite a bit of this um, for me. Scrape it and level it back up and then reseed it. So that way we can use it as, I was doing circles around me, um, kind of use it as a um, small grass paddocks for the stalled horses that I keep up. Um, right now, the girls have been in the back pasture because um, we're not riding them and they're not up and I'm not working with them. But Shiloh is pregnant. I'm more than certain. And I brought her up yesterday just to love on her. And sometimes I do that, just just need, name a girl, my running mate. And uh, spoiler just a little bit, she's eating my grass because I'm too I'm too lazy to mow and I really don't like to weed eat so let her out for a little bit her little round belly starting to get real cute for you guys that don't know gestation cycles on horses they're not like humans or beef cattle well any any cattle um, they're nine months whereas horses take 11 so we won't have a baby till late fall. My best guess is October, hopefully. Um, it, it's her first baby, so you never know how it's gonna go. Um, but I just brought her up so I could ride her, um, light rider, and help me work with Leo a little bit. I'm gonna muff out her stall. So I'm just gonna go throw her out in the arena. I'm gonna pull Scooter out, throw him out in the arena, grab Jalen's little Rocky, throw him out in the arena, and then we're going to work with Leo. And maybe find some lunch. Because the sun is shining. Now that I took care of all my business calls this morning, I had class and then that got interrupted. So, just playing catch up. I'm a couple weeks behind on my homework, so tomorrow it's supposed to rain. So that's like I'm dividing all my attention tomorrow to a few things that I need to get done. And then I'm going to catch up on my classwork work with IBCA at Texas A&M. And go from there. What are y'all doing? You enjoying the day? Is it sunny? I talked to uh, Suzanne earlier, the WT Farm Girl. 
go check her out. If you don't know who I'm talking about, she's pretty awesome. She does hay. She has ponies um, in Michigan. Um, we were collaborating and talking about some hay. Um, she called Jason asking his thoughts on Tef because we're going to play it some too. <sighs> See if I can do this one handed. Yeah, there you go. So, we'll go get the boys and turn them out. And... Yeah. Let's go ride. Come here. So, uh, this is the Oxy Sower 7. Uh, I use it on Scooter for his respiratory. And he's not overly fond of me sometimes. But it helps you breathe, don't it, buddy? Yes. Better spell some more. Make sure you talk to your vet. Um, we are a licensed dealer for your local. If you have questions, it's in the description below. That's my butt. Are you your father's horse? This is Jason's horse. Let me go outside. Pretty cool.